Welcome back to Dobre Cars, where fast is a lifestyle. Today we have another exclusive opportunity. Shout out to RDS Automotive for having us here today. We are here at one of our close family members' house, also known as the Godfather. You guys have seen us here before. We're about to review one of the hottest cars on the market. Actually one of the first, if not the first in the US. Lucas, take it away. So of course here we have the A2F Copa Tintillon. Basically the super car, race car version of the A12. I mean, this is, the, this is the first time I'm seeing it in person. I'm really excited. You know, I'm the Ferrari guy. So, I mean, here it is. Like, it's insane. You know, keeping it low key, but also making a loud statement. Naturally aspirated V12, just like the previous A12, but with a lot more aerodynamic progression and a lot more cool features. So, Lucas, Marcus, you guys want to take it away? You're the Ferrari expert. I mean, yeah, this is definitely a hardcore version of the A12. It has 30 more horsepower, and on the market, they're going for like 1.6 million. So, yeah, and the MSRP is a little over 700. So right here, that's why I love Ferrari so much. It's like, I wish I could have got this car. Maybe next time. Maybe hey, you already know, we're about to take this on the road, but first, let's take a little in-depth look. As you guys know, this is a front engine Italian muscle car. So Lucas, go ahead and pop that hood. Let's see that beautiful engine. Here we go, guys. Wow, beautiful. Ferrari, handmade, V12, naturally aspirated engine. I love the red color, such a signature thing of Ferrari, and actually it's called a midship mount engine because it's actually placed behind the front wheels rather than in front. The dynamics that go into this car and the speed. We got the plated Ferrari logo right there, beautiful. And I'm starting to notice the little, you know, the little trims, the red we got on the engine. And if you look at the tires right here on the Pirelli P0s, we got the red trim right on the outside to match perfectly with the brakes as well. This is a beautiful spec, everyone. This is a very exclusive and rare opportunity we have. Let's go ahead and follow it into the interior where we have some beautiful red stitching as well, matching the seat belts. Take a look, Christian. It's beautiful. Wow. Well, come look at the back. It looks way better than a regular A12. Look at these exhausts. I love the placement on that. We got full carbon fiber, the diffuser, everything. This is crazy. Lucas and Marks, you guys had the A12 super fast Stallone before. Do you think they're gonna come out with a body kit for this one or it's just already perfect the way yeah, it is, right? That's perfect. Yeah, it's already perfect the way it is. Um, my favorite part of this car is the back. It's just so big and bulky, it's sexy. As you can see, the carbon airfoil, it's sick to help with downforce. I mean, Lucas, just say it how you see it. The car has a nice fat booty, right? You like that, dude. Come on. And one small detail I noticed was the rear view camera. It's right there. Come on. That's... Yo, shout out to Ferrari. That's cool. That's creative. I like that. It's sharp. I know we keep talking about the engine, how it's red. You guys have heard of the Ferrari Testarossa. Technically, every Ferrari is a Testarossa because that means red head. The head, technically the brain here of the car is red, so... Now you guys know something new. Yo, check this out. So our old A12 actually did not have this rear view camera right here. That's sick, bro. Yo, look at there he is. Go down more. Go down. <laughs> This is insane, bro. And look, look how dark it is back there. It has no back window, as you guys can see. All right, so Lucas, we just saw a ton of carbon fiber. How much does this A12 weigh compared to the previous one that so you guys had? So it weighs had? around 32 to 3,300 pounds. It actually saved three over 300 pounds in Yo. weight. And it has 830 horsepower. That's insane. I did not believe they would save that much weight. So honestly, it might be a good competitor for the 720. Even the Pista as well. It's, it's definitely up in the top three for yeah. speed, for sure. GT2, I'll lose, but I'm okay with that. <laughs> hey, at the end of the day, that also comes down to the driver as well. But if we had perfect shifts, 
it would be an interesting race. This is for sure faster than the Peace Pass, for sure. All right, I think it's time to get to the fun part. You guys want to drive it? Let's go. And guys, check this out. We're going to be trailing. We're going to be trailing the A12 with the Bentley Flying Spur right over there. So, you know, a little double whammy treat for you guys. I'll hop in the Bentley and uh, Lucas is going to be inside the A12 getting some footage and we'll be on the outskirts. So let's see what happens. Cool. Let's go. Make sure you guys give this video a thumbs up, subscribe, turn on those post notifications. Let's have some fun. Alright. Let's go. Yeah, I'm going to be uh, chilling in the back today because it's very comfy back there. Hey, if you put your mind on anything, you can for sure accomplish your dreams. That's why we're doing these videos to influence you guys and motivate you guys that anything's possible. You got anything to say? Bro, I can't wait to see it. I can't wait to hear it, bro. The B12. Bro, that A12 is insane, bro. We gotta put that against the 720, the Pista, the GT2. Definitely gonna lose. <laughs> but I'm okay with that. I'm okay, I'm okay. I'm okay with that. Alright, let's get in the car. Alright, guys, we won the A12 now. We're about to go for a spin. This is about to be insane, bro. I'm in a Ferrari right now. We're always killing it. Alright, let's go for a ride. Yo, that, that sounds crazy. Yeah, here we get. Dude, it just, the V12 never gets boring, guys. It's like music. I'm not gonna hold you the view from back here. It looks like you guys are in like a limo right now. Oh, yeah, we're chilling. Go. Yo, it sounds so good. <laughs> The best thing is here in that V12. That's insane. Woo! That is a beautiful, beautiful Ferrari. And I'm not gonna lie, chilling in this Bentley Flying Spur, I'm having a great day today. Great day. How does it feel like sitting back there? Smooth you guys ride. Like kings. Smooth ride, man. Um, you know, we got uh, our brother as chauffeur. <laughs> <laughs> I'm, I'm glad to be your chauffeur any day, Cyrus, well, as long is... as I'm driving a flying spur. <laughs> wow. I love the spec on that car. So stealth. And you know, a car like that, you can make it black because the body of it speaks loud enough for itself, literally to show what the car is made of, like, you know? That was insane. I mean, the A12 is one of the most comfortable Ferraris ever built, but when you really get on the gas, that thing is crazy fast. I want to put it against the 720. That would be a good race. Big difference from your last A12? Yeah, for sure. 300 pounds lighter. 300 yeah. pounds and gaining 30 to 40 horsepower. That's, that should be, that's insane. That's awesome. We had a nice comfortable ride in the Flying Spur. It was nice, it was hey, nice. You guys like like bosses in there. Really? Yeah. Dude, you, I mean, you look like a boss yourself in there, man. That was fresh. You think yeah. you would ever get one in the future? I mean, if, if we had the chance to get one, for sure, but that's too too rare to get right now. Wow, what a, what an experience today, guys. Stay tuned, more exclusive cars and races to come on Dobre Cars. We love you guys so much. Make sure you guys like and subscribe, and we'll see you next time. That's right, guys. Drive safe. God bless. Peace.